Been a great stretch of weather. A little cool for some folks this morning, though. 42 in Burlington and Lake Geneva. It was 52 here in Milwaukee, 48 in Port Washington. But that dry air, while well, it cools down very quickly at night, also warms up very nicely during the day. And we're going to be stuck in this streak for quite a while. Oh, it's going to be great. Sunny, low humidity, light wind, not just for today, but for the rest of the week. We're not giving it a pick day. We're giving it a pick week out there. Yesterday was nice, except for the breeze, and that looks like it might be the worst day of the week. Not a cloud in the sky across Milwaukee. 77 degrees, southwest wind at 9. It's already 77. Dew points are in the upper 40s. The temperatures in the 60s and 70s, 60 in Port Washington, excuse me, 66 of the southeast wind has developed there, mid to upper 70s, elsewhere almost 80 in Janesville. You don't have to go very far away from the lakefront to get that warming effect, but it's already starting to cool down in Grafton and Sockville until the lower 70s. It is 75 uh, in Mequon and 71 up towards Belgium with that southeast wind. There's the southwesterly wind at 5 to 10, southeasterly wind right along the lakefront, except for at the airport. It is currently a southwest wind. Dew points continue to be in the 40s and 50s, back off to the west, a little bit more humid. Humid, but that's where that will stay as well as high pressure is acting as a roadblock, keeping that humid air into Minnesota, western Wisconsin and into Iowa. And that's the best chance of seeing some rain showers as well. The dew points remain in the 50s all week and into the weekend. And today's Goddard gauge, we're going to give it a 10 and I have a feeling we're going to be using a lot of them. I had to go buy some extra ones because 76 today, 70 at the lakefront and I'll be getting to drop southeast ones at 5 to 15 low humidity. If you like today, you're going to like pretty much every day for the rest of the week. There's the front. It's, act, it's slowing down. It's stalling out and that's going to be the focal point for clouds and showers the next couple of days. Not here, but western Wisconsin, Minnesota and Iowa, even the Dakotas as it's not going anywhere. It's high pressure to our east. It's is blocking it so we continue to be status quo sunny light winds and mild lows tonight dropping back into the 50s could see a little bit of patchy fog back into the mid to upper 70s tomorrow but right along the lakefront low 70s to even the upper 60s with that light southeasterly breeze so for today temperatures already in the mid to upper 70s southeast wind keeping a little bit cooler at the lakefront tonight some patchy fog developing at a low temperature of 56 great sleeping weather and this continues day after day after day nice rut to be in Mid to even lower 70s. Lows will be in the 50s. Hardly a cloud to be found. Saturday is 72. Continues for Sunday at 73. And it continues into next week. If you're looking for rain, that won't happen until at least next Wednesday.